the song come on. Right. Mm, uh, eat, eat, you know what I'm saying? You know, that's when you turn that shit down. Look, you thought, yeah. You know I like to be this. You know, I ain't gonna be riding beating this shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? Look over to the car. Grandma in that motherfucker. I know she listening to this shit. I mean, it's a catchy song. That's what I'm saying. It's but, catchy. But, but, you don't but go. Why I say she had to stop potential. Like, like I said, she raps with a group of girls. Like one of them also got signed to QC right Two after she did. Right? A few more of them. I, I wouldn't be surprised. But what I'm saying though, when you watch it, look at all of them. It's like, all right, shorty rap better. Shorty rap better. She more she, entertaining. All right. She's more into. She just. She she steps off the screen. She, she's she, a Nelly. She performs she's the better. Era. She stands better on camera. She looked like she's supposed to be there. She's the fifty. She's the one when we got a squad. Somebody gonna go. Somebody somebody gonna uh, step to the forefront because they got the look, the part. Like you don't know what it is. It's just like, damn, I see it. Like I see it. I don't know why, but I can see. Like she, she like you. You were saying before I hit record. She ain't got the ass. She ain't got the body. She ain't got the woo woo woo. It's plenty of them out there who don't got that though. Yeah, now and it's plenty. Thanks to Corey Ray, shout out. She set the tone no, back for that. It, no, 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 no. I'm not talking about in the industry. I'm talking about in the world. I'm saying regular world. people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's about being able. <laughs> but to it's the song. It, Somebody gave her a beat. And she went out. I told you. Hit Kid is a person who has already. He was working with all of them. He had all of them putting them on songs. Stuff. I wouldn't be surprised. If he oh, had okay. So he probably was. He probably. It's was not just her song. It says Hit Kid and Guru. Yeah, 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 I know. I'm saying. I wonder what. They from Memphis. They okay, all from okay, Memphis. Okay. Okay. So you probably didn't peep the grind. But it wasn't. But what I'm saying, he got all the girls who got signed and rapping. Mm -hmm. He was already making songs with them. Some, okay. Like he was. He got. Mm -hmm. But it, it was that tone. It was that, like you said, they already been making music, yeah. but they got one yeah. and they knew it. It could have been any one of them if they would have projected that motherfucker, but she probably took that motherfucker and went, oh, oh, ooh, okay. It might have been just that one day they was in the studio together and the motherfucker and they, found that bop. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and they probably been, been here. You know? Probably been sitting on it, waiting on what the right said, time to release she it. She said, she, she, they, she talks about that though. Cause she said, no, nah, they just record. She said they just recorded that. Cause like everybody was like, oh, you got the song with Duke Deuce, cause the fuck nigga free. And she like, nah, man, Deuce did that song in February. We ain't do uh, oh, that song in that, May yeah. or okay. some shit like that. Yeah. They just did the song. I think she said in like April. I, she one already, of the interviews that she was doing, she said that. She but, was already established in Memphis. Already built. Yeah, yeah that, that what I'm saying. Like that one, the songs with her and the other girls and he kid got six hundred k. Seven before because I seen this as soon as FNF came out, I'm like, who is she? Yeah. Like I'm starting to hear the song, I'm starting to hear the song. It ain't I ain't I ain't heard everybody, you know what I'm saying? Cause I kinda got an ear for when I hear something I'm like, oh yeah, this shit gonna go. Like, it's another song, the young baby tape. It's a girl. I'm like, oh girls gonna love this song when I first heard it. And of course everybody. But that song was out for months before it took off. That's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, maybe not much. Because like I said, they didn't put the song out until like April or some shit like that. I remember But I looked, the, uh, I, I YouTubed her. I searched her name and I started watching old shit. I'm like, okay, who is, who the rest of these motherfuckers is? Yeah. I, I, I saw dude that, like I said, from my what? Skin Bone dude. Mm -hmm. He did a rap to that motherfucker. Yeah, a lot of people did. But it was, I heard that, I, don't, I heard that before that song really, so it was taking off. I guess it was probably taking off with Cali. Taking off benefits, taking off. It took its time to get around, to make it around. No, it's an internet song. That's what I'm saying. It's so an I, internet song, so it right, shit so don't radio take really ain't pick it up. Right, radio didn't internet. pick it up as, as quick as the internet. Motherfuckers, you know, you know, you know. All right, the girls got something. Let's make our version, and everybody wants to make their version. Like the fucking, I don't know if you heard it, the, the, the vision song, the if I get caught cheating, that mean I don't love you, that shit. Now you got everybody making responses and Brandy got Tiny and the fucking, uh, what's the, the yeah, yeah, yeah. from uh, Escape. Escape Day. Oh, that what that was? Like, yeah. That's a division song. I wonder why they doing a young song like that. Because it was like, and then Jermaine Dupri did it, you know, so. Jermaine Dupri is his beat. No, he, he produced a song. He produced. He helped produce and write. According to the dude from Division, he came up with the hook with the if I get caught cheating part. 
So he helped write the song and, and produce it. So, you know, but the internet, this is internet shit. That's how this shit spread. You can't get motherfuckers to talk about it and want to recreate it just like a freestyle. How motherfuckers was like, the Millie beat. The Millie beat became so, so great because everybody wanted to rap on it. And that's what FNF did. Like, it's a million different niggas that got a FNF response. And that don't do shit. Now you hit a beat, the beat recognizable. But it's, that's why, <clears throat> that's why I seem like Everything else around the blue quicker because they wanted everybody to like it and not just for girls. So they let everybody play around with the song before they release the actual, like really push, not release, but really push it. I say, like you say, let the dudes get their rap on because dude, if, if that song would have been like it is now, how many dudes really, really rapped on it? Let's just say like Vincent, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't trying to just let's let say like the, with the old, old, what is it, dude name? Uh... Who did the Miley Cyrus uh, song? Mike Will made it? No, uh, Miley Cyrus' daddy song. Oh, uh, Lil Nas X. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That song, when that song first came out, everybody was doing it. Remixes, versions of it, and all that shit. Mm-hmm. Like that. Yeah, it's the internet. The internet takes shit over. The internet takes shit over. It's, that's just a way of today's time. And you, like you said, the dude, like, and she got. She don't rap in a way where it's like, hey, right, she talking about her pussy and fucking and all that shit. But she ain't doing it. She ain't got the voice that I'm trying to be overly sexy on some Megan shit or some shit like that to where she just put my pussy in your face, eat my pussy, all this other ass shit. They so ain't She's like her saying, song, though. All them songs they and got. And make it easier for dudes to listen to her, her verses and songs. This girl song... It's bigger than all of their songs because it's she not. made an anthem for them. That's an anthem for them. Megan had one too, though. We can't. What? Do the fucking first, very first song that she had. What's that the name one? of it? Um, what the fuck is it? You think that's going to be a bigger anthem than this? Yeah. This right here got meaning Megan, to it. Megan got A girl could break over that nigga and start, she fuck nigga free. Yeah, she, uh, she created a, a, a slogan, yeah. That's but, what I'm saying. I mean, Megan got a girl summer. What you talking about? Okay, I, I, okay, all right. This song gonna be here for 30 years, 40 years. Megan got some 40 year songs. For, for women, yeah. I understand Megan what? Got I, some. I understand it, that, that, uh, the shit, when I mean, she, she took, uh, she uh, that, that shit ain't going nowhere. That too. Oh yeah, well, there you go. Enough said. But okay, that's one of those type of songs. Yeah, yeah. This is one of them type of songs. Yeah, no, it is. Everybody got their big hit. You can search all these artists. You be like, like the fucking cowboy song. The uh, his very first song. I I, I was looking at something else and it popped out. That she got two hundred and thirty million views. I'm like, I didn't know that song had two hundred and thirty million oh, yeah. views. Like, you'd be surprised. I'd be like, what? But just like dude, that I seen the dude. It's a video. It's the dude, I don't know the dude, but he dressed like Rick James. He got the braids. He's sitting in the grass. He's standing in the grass, rapping, singing. It looked like an old type of video look thing. But I seen this, I seen this on the uh on the fucking internet. Just it's like I guess he was, I don't know if it was like an actual he's video. You talking about uh what's my boy's name? Fuck what's his name? He said dude signed Lou Will. I don't know who he's saying with. I know he on tour with a big ass rock group now. Oh, with a rock group, so that probably No, nah, he black. I know. So he ain't doing so he ain't doing uh, black music. I mean, that's black music. He that's universal music. Okay, well nah, that ain't, we ain't talking about the same thing. I don't know who you're talking about. I figure I will let you know. So yeah, I mean it's not in today's time, like if you got if you got that one song that can Spark some conversation, get the motherfuckers on the internet talking. You got it. You got it. That's all I tell you one song. That's what T Green just said. Said one song. I had one song. I you got out and recorded one movie. song. And then one song did that. Yeah. Like most shit. people. We watch you we were talking about rap shit. You watch rap shit. That's what I mean. They got one, one song. song. And now they in New York at the Spotify party and motherfuckers know who they is. You know what I'm saying? But that's, that's, that's most of most of a lot of artists. Yeah, come out that one song and just be like, Cause it ain't like it ain't it ain't like a lot of motherfuckers just stop 
like just just started making music. Some of them say, yeah, I, this is my first song, but you got you know motherfuckers. It, that that you was, yeah, yeah, you was my friend. Yeah, you somebody homie. You part of somebody click. You was already down yeah. traveling. And, and they had you around for a reason because they knew you had talent. Exactly. Just like I ain't know, like I was I was I was checking out the, uh Matt Hoffa and when he had Bird on there. Okay. Yeah. And he was talking about how, you know what I'm saying, him and Cat one cool, and you know what I'm saying? I, like, I ain't know that. I, now, I know all these artists, but now he said it all makes sense. You know what I'm saying? I already knew he was damn Max and homie and all that, but yeah, it all makes right. sense now how their music was coming out because they knew people then. Like, didn't my, like, Cat had shit was look like a fucking Interscope record. Like, book, CD, books, covers, features. If I'm not mistaken, he like, was. He's on Motown. Yeah, so that's... that's some shit like that. That's, that's an album. But yeah, no, you gotta... It, it, it is who you know. It was I would say it was more so who you know knew then. Because there's a lot of artists now who who didn't been signed, failed, popped back up, rebranded, came out, finally got a song. So now you probably, you probably know people now and it helped a little bit, but that shit ain't help you. In the beginning, because you didn't already failed as an artist. Like one of the biggest R and B singers now, Lucky Day, nigga was on like American Got Talent or American Idol or some shit like that. Grass. He lost. He was with Neo. He was writing and shit like that, helping write shit. Mm -hmm. Couldn't get shit to pop for himself, and then boom, he get a song that blows up. Like it, you, it just it. It's really about the music. Bro. I'm sure that's Neo's story too. You probably been writing, 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 I writing. Heard, I know watched plenty of uh, Neo interviews. He definitely started off as a writer. He definitely started off as a writer. But that's that's what I'm saying though. It's about the song. If you don't make good music, it ain't going. It ain't going. It ain't. It's just not going to work. A lot of these motherfuckers are talented writers. Like and you gotta know how to get in the space. Cause I man, I swear I want to write some music for these motherfuckers, man. Let me. I need to know who to get around, man. I got a lot of songs. Not even raps. Talking about R and B shit. That's that's about shit. networking. Motherfuckers got to be vocal, and that's the thing about being being present in the moment. You got to be able to command a room and, and talk to people and, and get yourself in the door. Like, you got to be Bobby Schmurter in the room. Huh? Nice ain't the dancing on the table. <laughs> I'm just saying though, how <laughs> you take over a room right there? Nah. He got he got he damn sure had everybody's attention. <laughs> I'm sure Smurder regret that shit though. No, he ain't. He said it, he ain't done now. No, 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 no. Motherfuckers going just, in there doing that. They what? They, it was just don't happen that his shit got recorded. Motherfuckers been doing that. You got to perform for the label. But why you think he regret doing that? And that's him every he day outside right day. now. He got on that. But day. that's how he, he is. That's why I don't understand why people act like he's shot when he go. Oh, million dollar worth of game and shit and get on the couch and start dancing and all that shit. He been dead to him. Yeah, no, that, that's, that's his character. That's him. Yeah, that, that's him, that's him. I'm not I'm not downplaying that that's being him. What you think about uh Charleston White ass getting dude as uh locked up, the rapper? I just the seen the I I only seen the headline. I ain't watch his video or really hear the story, but I'm not surprised. I'm not you surprised. Told him, man. Leave me alone. No, he told him who he was and who he worked for. I mean, the man say he's hey, the man wild boy. The but man he also say, he, say go ahead, go he go said, ahead. "I'm here, I'm right here. <laughs> we in we in Atlanta right now." The man said he got on another plane and went to a whole another destination. Said we here, where you at? And a dude pull up and the people that way. <laughs> Come on, man. All right, look. The man, wild as hell, say, man. Hey, hey, he, hey, I'm just saying, hey, he told him to come right, down right, here. Right. I'm right here. <laughs> getting people locked up, not cool. But if but we, is he getting them locked up? Or they getting themselves locked up? Because he told him. Because you threatening me, he told him. All right, fuck it. I'm going to let you know when I'm there. Right. So if, if he was there, if he was there, and the motherfucker just so happened to be there and whack him, then what? No, for sure. For sure. But don't, don't, but you playing with people, though, bro. Don't, you don't have to do that. 
He don't, but it's you don't have his to say. Part of him. It's, he told motherfuckers that he's playing a character. Yeah. Just like everybody else is. Yeah. But he wants motherfuckers to understand what's wrong with him playing this character and everybody else playing their character. Why I can't play my character? Now, I ain't condoning what he's saying. I'm just saying, you know, I know two sides of every story. But you, so don't got, you don't got, you don't got to in, 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 it, insert yourself into the No, you don't have to. But why not? Just like with anything else. You don't have to do nothing but people. He didn't have to shit. answer the FaceTime or whatever it was. He didn't have to allow the nigga on the live. Or why? His life. Because this is his don't life have at this to, point. Though. He getting paid off this. But this you is know, life. I understand that. But that's something you don't have to do. But see, now I was actually going to say something in defense of him. You nigga, niggas in the streets playing, you know, shoot them up games. That's your way of hurting the motherfucker. That could be his way of hurting. That's what I'm saying. So, so why, when he been his character, like everything is like like he said, everybody playing a character in life. Anyway, when you go outside the door, goddamn, you putting that character on. When you come back at home, you, you know what I'm saying. You can say what the fuck you want to say. Shit that you can't say into a motherfucker's face. Yeah. He don't have to though. That's but, what I'm saying. He don't have to. I'm not look. It's entertaining. It's look, entertaining for us sitting now. They don't have to look at it. They don't gotta. They never had to. But get you know what? They have never him no book. Is, but hey, but you didn't have to feed into it. Now the point I just thought of. Okay, people playing the character, right? But the characters don't don't usually come into play with each other. We just watch like if you watch basketball, you seen. Paolo Bantero, number one pick this year, Jonte Murray, doing all that wolfing, talking, yeah. bullshit. Right. And they just played at the, the Seattle game last night, shaking hands, yeah. smiling and shit. It's bullshit. But you know basketball like that anyway. But that's what I'm saying. They spar. You, but he's intentionally picking at street motherfuckers. Who gon' who, But they're also intentionally allowing it because they're bringing his name up. And not only that, he bringing he bringing attention to something. Do you think Dirk now should have said something to him in that club? No. Exactly. Nobody we should. That's what I'm to. saying. We that's don't, that's exactly what I'm saying. saying. But they we are. Don't have to though. So you can't get mad at him. But people and will say. you said he's shit. But people will say. Oh, Dirk now they some bitches, they some hoes, cause they didn't approach Charles and White. He was in the club. It was just him and one other nigga. But guess what? But then he was but, 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 but Dirk never made a respond. But Dirk never don't respond to shit like that. Who cares? My fucker call LeBron all kind of shit. He don't respond. Who cares? Don't exactly. you don't have to respond. Exactly. Exactly. You, you you give them what you they want when you respond. But look who he's getting the responses from. I don't even know. They clown chasing him at the exactly. point. We play. only know who Buddy is now because of this video with Charles White. I never heard a dude. But if he right, that's what I'm saying. He clown chasing him. Yeah, yeah. Now course. at this yeah. point, he being clown chasing. Yeah. Yeah, they all clown chasing though. He doing it for content. If you're doing anything for content, that's clown chasing. But. They clown chasing, getting them locked up. Yeah, dumb as fuck. Dumb, you don't gotta call the police though. That's the thing though. You can. You saved my life. Police. He told them. He told them I'm a civilian. He told them that, and you threatening my life. You can't be threatening people. You shouldn't be threatening people. I agree. I stay away from everybody. I don't want no issues with you. I don't know you. Fuck you. All that shit. Me either. Then like if he ever see this, he may see something that I said or you said. You know, so guys, it's cool. You ain't gonna get none of respond out of me. But I ain't worried about that because I go I'm back and forth. I go too. back and forth with Charles and White. Shit, I ain't got no problem with it. I ain't gonna threaten right. shit. I'm a civilian too. Me nigga too. Look. <laughs> <laughs> he, gonna, he gonna be an ally. He, he gonna make your ass an ally. I ain't he, gonna make, he, he gonna like, nah, nigga, I can't get nothing out of this. He will here ignore you. He can't do the pot. If a motherfucker can't get him. I go ahead and do the pot. He yeah. say he like helping motherfuckers. Like he said with the breeze. Nah, that'd, he be, told that'd be about five bands. He yeah. told him, uh... And he'll love to come to Chicago. Just say he came to Chicago and did in Chicago. Yeah. Hey, it's beautiful there. Hey, hey, it was, I, I, I ain't giving... <laughs> I was right down the street. I was right down the street. Oh, man. And I was right down the street from what it be. Hey, it looked like a world of war zone, but shit, hey. <laughs> hey, that 
nigga is he fucking hilarious though. And a lot of people know who he is though. Now a lot of people know he is. He, it's some new shit every day. That's the thing. Oh no, this mug is a celebrity. There's some new shit every day with him. It's a matter of time before Tim V start talking to him. Catch him in the street. Hey Charleston, yeah. That's gonna be crazy, man. That's really gonna <laughs> That's crazy. But I could not do that. That's what I'm saying. It's people out here just don't care and will be successful off that. I couldn't go out there. I know I can go out there and do some stupid ass shit and get a million views right now. That's I know I could. You know I know. It's some shit I can go out there and do right now. It's get a million fuck. Hell no, it ain't worth it. That's what I'm saying. It's people out here that do shit that ain't worth it and to capitalize off of it and then uh, get into the minds of the people be like, I guess it was worth it. But that's but is it worth it or isn't it worth it? I mean, you can look at people who've done it in and the positions that they put ended up in. Look at the Boom Gang nigga, Boom Gang, going started off going in hopping over the counter eating donuts and shit. Right. The, evolved into a drug addict, falling asleep on interviews, hitting walls at Adam Twenty Two. He was already all these a drug addict. And these, and <laughs> shit. shit. He was now already. He, he was now, just one. He just could afford it now. Now he uh, what is his new name? I forgot his new name. John John Gabbana or some shit like that. And he's a, a, a man of God now. You know what I'm saying? But you got all these tattoos. You did all this shit already. Shit, the chick. What's the chick name? Uh, I don't know if he was already like that. Y'all. I don't want to put no none his name. I don't uh, know this guy. I'm Selena, a- Selena Powell, the one who was fucking acting. All the rappers had Cardi and Offset beef and trying to say she. Yeah, that was two years ago. What's wrong with her? She locked up. For oh, for uh, for she had all cases. Uh, yeah, some she had some yeah, cases yeah, already. Yeah, she yeah. Yeah. It's just like the other girl too. A lot of them turned to crackheads. You got more shots now. That was yeah. That was that was. Uh, Instagram superstar. That's because it's a picture on the other side of that camera. It's fucked up. It's real life. I could pick a corner on the fucking wall to take a picture. Real life. But when you look on the other side of that motherfucker, maybe a motherfucker standing there with a gun in my face. It ain't just a picture, though. It's social media. Motherfucker go on social media. Motherfucker just get a little six thousand dollar check, cash it, get the camera. Motherfucker probably don't get a check for another six months. But they, they, oh yeah, big, big bands, big bands. But you, but you can tell that they just got it. Cause you ain't never rushed to do this until you got it. Yeah. That's one thing I refuse to do. Yeah. Get on there and counsel for your money. I think I did. I think I sold a little cash one time out at work. Cause they showed some shit like, oh, and I just, you know what I'm saying? What I had in my pocket, I just took a little. And did him. It was nothing. It was just playing and joking around and shit. But just sitting on that motherfucker like I'm just yeah. loaded, putting money in my ear and all this goof ass shit. Nah. Yeah, we was doing that in Houston as a parody. Like I had motherfucking. I mean, I had like seventy dollars in my pocket. Like, cause I don't really carry cash like that, and I'm just like in the bitch and just look up. But that's not. We that doing that shit with the real party. It's just something to do at that time. It ain't nothing that you rushing home to do. These motherfuckers get cash checks and rush home to lay it, got their whole shit laid out. A whole set. Light on the camera, point oh, yeah. to them, bed, how they yeah. gonna spread the money out, make sure they don't see that dollar. All in the name of content. It's all in the name of content. Cause you gotta post something to get some interaction or some shit like that. And 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 to be perfectly honest, people thinking something that you will probably get you further than it actually being you. In a lot of cases, these people are naive. People are, people are, people are not as smart as we like to give them credit for. Eventually, it'll wear off. You can only fake it for so long, but if you can get there, maybe you'll have something now, and you ain't gotta fake it no more. But that's the whole concept of fake it till you make, make it. it. But ain't it, it ain't it fucked up how easily the brain is manipulated? Like you see it, I remember it. You know what I'm saying. Jay Z came out, yeah. reasonable doubt, whatever. You know, he talking, he talking this slick shit, this money shit. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I really couldn't understand it. Then here come motherfucking cash money, bling bling. Yeah, everything. Yeah, got my hands in there, bling bling, throwing money. I, this wasn't like this at first. Like people probably want a Magic City or these strip clubs or whatever, making it rain and all that shit, local drug dealers and all that shit. I'm sure that's where they got it from, but. 
the way it got to the inner city minds, like, this is what I'm supposed to do. I got to show my money. That's why a lot of people get robbed. That's why a lot of people get killed. Because, like you say, when you flexing this money you ain't got, when the man come rob you and you ain't got it, guess what? He ain't convinced you ain't got it. You telling the truth, man, you ain't got it. Nick, where that money at? That's a different suit, though. It's a different, like, with the Jay-Z shit. Jay-Z know what not the spreading bands. You know what I'm saying? They go to the club, bow all the crystal or some shit like that. Plenty. I ain't gonna... Yeah, no, 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 I can't let you get away with that. Jermaine and Pree and Jay-Z uh, Jay was riding that motherfucker. But that's what I'm saying. Throwing but money I, over a mountain. Different, 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 different settings. So that's what I was finna say. It's a difference between... Bigger city cats and down south cats. That's why I often say it's a difference in every like because you made the cash money comparison. It's different. It's more flashy, like you said. The strip club scene down there is different. You can't. You can only barely show titties in New York. So when motherfuckers is going in there. Yeah, they going in there throwing some money and shit. But it ain't a part of the 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 what this is when you come here down south. You go up the motherfucker asshole naked popping pussy in that bitch and we they fuck going up. They fucking in all the clubs. But you see the difference between Jay Z here. The plan, what is? I'm gonna do this, 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 this to the point now. They my shot where I shot. He, he, he. <laughs> I wouldn't say he shot where you shot. Damn. No, I'm not saying that. I not saying that. Shit like not, saying that. not saying that. I'm not saying that. But what I'm saying though, you nah, get big shirt enough. Be, them shirts be fucking thousand dollars. That's what I'm that saying. Shit, that little it, bullshit you be having on me. <laughs> Motherfucker, $10,000 outfit. Exactly. Like, that ain't everybody talking about that. No, it's it's quality. It's the, like, you get big enough to where you don't want no logos on your shit. And I can wear this. I can wear this for five years. Because, like you say, it's the brand. Now I'm, now I'm at the point where I'm buying the quality. Mm-hmm. So if I get it clean and clean and clean, it's going to remain the same. That's yeah. what that's, that's the, the value within the fabric now. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. It ain't... I ain't Drying my shirts and they shrinking and shit. Well, like, that's the thing about being over there in Italy. It's when you're now you're getting some fresh from Italy shit where they done woven this shit. This shit ain't stitched and sewn. Yeah, this, this shit is woven. And now you feeling that shit like, damn, this shit do feel good. Now you getting these bitches imported and flown in and lifetime shit like that. Warranty you know on what I'm saying? Like, and shit. Like, hey, now you really ball. You can get a lifetime warranty on a t-shirt. Hey, I'm sure it's made. Nice. Some brand might do it now. Send it back. If it, we guarantee our fabric. You know what I'm saying? Like, Man. they guarantee like this shit is long lasting and it's comfortable yeah. and it's more comfortable. Nigga look comfortable. Yeah. Jay Z look comfortable. Hop out the main That's the thing about like I, who am I? Who do I got to? Who do I got to impress? I don't have to impress nobody. My car has cost your whole life. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. You seen me with the rich and Millie. You you know I got that in the boat. You the know. Millie. But that's a, that's what he do do though. His watches. His watches is Jay Z thing. If you notice all his pictures, he do this or he show whatever he got on his wrist. He be having a two million dollar Audemars and all that. But that's what I'm saying. But that's that rich, rich shit. Yeah, yeah. One chain. Yeah, little chain. Little you know, small chain. Probably like 90K. Five million dollars. <laughs> five million dollars. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're right. You're right. My bad. With a motherfucker and a carry diamond on it. That like Kevin Hart when they were sitting there on the fucking yeah. on the heart to heart shit or whatever. Like, them niggas is up there looking like money. God damn yeah. it. Yeah, but not overdoing it. Not over. But, see, those but, are the type but, of niggas. Okay, don't, look, Floyd Mayweather, the ultimate stunner. Oh, yeah, that motherfucker got a mil- uh, $30 million watch. He's a different nigga. Floyd a different type of nigga. This nigga got every... All my cars black. Why we, and I got I got this one in white, too. Baby I got all these in white. I, I, a couple niggas do that, though. Because motherfuckers don't be knowing about certain motherfuckers, though, like... Because they not on... And Babyface an older nigga, too, though. <laughs> You would know it. Baby face keep on. Hey, hey. I bet you that's what we need to hear some real stories about stuff like that. Let's say like Floyd Mayweather, Jay-Z, 50, all these motherfuckers, they just chilling at a motherfucker uh, at that event and baby face walk in. Mm. Now, all these motherfuckers got money. But this boy been getting money. Yeah, since been getting money, goddamn. Since been getting money. With Michael Jackson that was getting money, you know. We talking about L.A. Reid now. We, mm-hmm. Get money, money. Boys and men now. So while your fighting going on, I'm producing these motherfuckers. They, they coming out saying the hell shit. Matter what that one. Shit, they look at Drake. They, uh, Nicki Minaj is out of them. <laughs> like, talk about, like, he don't want y'all to know he a billionaire. Basically, like, right. yeah. Of course. 
Yeah. That boy said everything right now. Well, he probably got 1.7. Yeah. Yeah, like, cause I think it was something about the airplane or some shit like that. The air Drake, the, the big ass airplane that he got. But she know that cause she know she had half a billion. Yeah. So if I know, if she's she looking at them, I'm like, come on now. I ain't even out here like you out here. And if I know what I got, come on. What you got? Yeah. Come on, stop it. But again, he one of the ones for you know he he flex he flex with his shit though he a flex here he just showed a ring that motherfucker with fat as hell pinky ring big ass diamonds all the he probably didn't wear that shit that, that's for pictures nah he flex he flex doing a whole making up his house it wasn't on MTV Cribs y'all know y'all know I'm building this here yeah y'all can watch the yeah. whole process. He said, I mean, he told me, like, I, I used to ride past this house with a girl in the car. I don't know, this might be some bullshit, but this is what he said. Nah, I rode past like, this with a chick, and I'm like, I'm about that house. Like, this is going to be where my house at. And he bought the land and built the house right there. That's just like if I hit that mega, I know where my house is going to be. Hey. I know where it's going to be. I know what I'm going to get. If I get that t- billion dollars, mm-hmm. I know the buildings I'm buying, I know what I'm doing with them. I know where they're gonna be. I'm getting a whole. I told you, I'm gonna get a whole fucking a oh, building. Yeah. I'm gutting that bitch out. Gym on the top floor. That whole side. Gym. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. A little indoor football field, arcade, all that shit on that side of the building. Like you know how them Coway buildings do. Over here, first floor. First of all, it's elevators both sides. Mm-hmm. First floor parking garage, indoor. Whole fifty cars. Go upstairs, first floor, second floor. Mm. In the back, studio, movie theater, all type of shit. In the Conway building. I don't know why motherfuckers don't know. I'm sure somebody got it. They just ain't let nobody see it. Them, all them buildings downtown and shit, off, off Lake Street, them factories, them big ass factories. That's some way I do that then. I need to build a. Like a fantasy factory, but my crib, everything in here. I ain't got to go nowhere. Nigga, hey, all in town, you know, Airbnb, I got the, the coldest penthouse suite for you. <laughs> Ice lay off. Make it make money, huh? They got to make money. If it don't make money, it don't make sense. Gee. Hey, I ain't mad at it. Because you know motherfuckers going to be wanting to come there and say, can I come here, yeah, nigga? You can, rent, you can rent out that area, that section. <laughs> that section. I, hey, I don't even know, though, if I would want something that big, though. Why not? You got a billion upkeep. dollars. Upkeep. 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 And I'm not going to be in that motherfucker like that. What would be the upkeep, though? You I gotta, would need more people right. to make it, to make it, more people around to make it but, worth it. No, y'all going to be, I'm going to have, a, it's going to be studio in here, yeah, everything. I, I, I don't know mean like a movie I studio. know, I know, I know what you're talking about. I mean like a movie, like you can film in this joint. Yeah, I know what you mean. I Green know screen. You mean. I know what you mean. But it's still like, oh, it's a lot. I don't know. I don't. I ain't never been a person who who envisioned the, the mega mansion with the thirty rooms and shit like that. Like, cause it's I like don't watch HG, uh, TV. I that see that home. stuff. Oh well, then she is I see it. I, I look at the world's most expensive homes, the million dollar home with the motherfucking big ass wall. Or that's a TV. All that shit. The whole fucking ceiling, the floor, TV. All hey, don't that shit be crazy? That should be like fifty million dollars. Yeah. But then you can buy that shit in Detroit, and that should be four million dollars. But see, that next one's they be in L.A. They be That's what LA. I'm saying. I'm saying right in the Midwest. L.A. is, you know, the property taxes is high and shit like that. Like what you were talking about with the world leaders, nigga? You want to talk about hey, that shit? Hey, I, hey. <laughs> Brown paper bag. Mm-hmm. But yeah, I mean, when you in L.A. and shit, shit, even in, even here, you going. You gonna pay more in taxes? Yeah, that's why I'm going. I'm, I'm, I'm not, places the south. They don't income tax. Huh? That's why. I'm, tax that's why I'm going. Stores. That's why I'm getting out of Chicago. That's why. That's why it's different. That's why Chicago, Chicago, Springfield, Springfield is different taxes. I mean, even though Illinois got Illinois tax, I think. But I don't think. Yeah, we gotta say that. But it ain't the same price living in the city. As it is living deep into the birds of Illinois. Nah, their their sales taxes and stuff is different. Liquor tax don't exist out there. Different counties. It's about the county. That's why we're going to another county in Illinois. 
It's it's uh I gotta drive to drive here for I was hours just gonna long. say that. I was just gonna say it's all about access to shit, but they putting everything out there. Like I prefer I would prefer like how now we gotta go downtown for shit because we live in the inner city. Like Well, you have an apartment downtown. I, I know that. What I'm, you talking I'm, about? I'm not talking about that's what I'm saying. Like I already know. I'm gonna have if I was to get to to that point, I would definitely have some I was just telling somebody that that I had something in the city. Just in case I'm in the city, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I don't feel like driving back. My fuck might be out here kicking it, and I'm like, I right, fuck it, I'm just gonna drive me off in my crib. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, no, nah. I'm aware of that. Bring like, that what's, 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 when the, I uh, Airbnb. what's the movie with uh, Adam Sandler and Kevin Garnett? How <laughs> he had the, the, the dip off crib with Shorty in it? Like, not saying there's gonna be no shorty. It's not hustle, but, but uh, 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 yeah, it's not hustle. Hustle. It's hustle. Hustle. Yeah, damn, it's hustle. Yeah. Yeah, but but yeah, like you were saying, like I was trying to give you a say into your whole world leadership. Is that oh, all it's about? Leader. It's yeah. all about owning this land and getting paid off of this land. Well, who you buy this motherfucking land from the owner? And land on the, the the land belongs to the living. Shit gonna grow on that land with your permission or not. You see what I'm saying? If all humans was was to not be on earth no more. Long as there's air, water, and sunlight, shit still gonna grow on earth. That's what I'm saying. I don't understand how we, we going through all this shit where we have a certain amount of group. I ain't gonna I ain't gonna get too deep. I don't need motherfuckers knocking at the door for my opinion. But we got a group of motherfuckers that can say what the fuck goes on in a, a group of five hundred or more, maybe a thousand people. We'll give it the benefit of that. Maybe a thousand. Maybe ten thousand. It don't fucking matter. There's billions of people on earth. And we all sitting around waiting on these motherfuckers to make a decision on whether they gonna end earth or not. It don't make sense to me. These motherfuckers don't have no more credibility or power than we do over this earth. Cause we all gonna die one day, right? Yeah. So what makes you have more power to say so what happens on this fucking planet than I got? And I'm sure that's why a lot of people have been protesting for a lot on that shit. I'm sure there's people out here that think like that. But it's to the point now where, okay, motherfuckers steady uh, threatening uh, nuclear this, nuclear that. How long do people got to sit around and let our lives be threatened? You know what I'm saying? That's just like... 193 um, members at the United Nations. We're going to 193 mm -hmm. versus billions. Okay, but these are representatives, first off. Like, we, I understand that. These are, okay, these are appointed representatives, right, who are, if you're in a democratic society, everything is voted on to an extent. There's some checks and balances. The way you say it, like, like, it's billions versus these 193 or whoever would be in charge. You know, once you, like, overthrow them, the people wouldn't be able to run the ship. It don't matter, but somebody we're threatening, but some, somebody, we're threatening to blow up the fucking earth. But bro. it would you you would stop it from you would stop it now. Just like why 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 is it always another Marvel movie? I, no, I understand threat. that it's always a villain. It's always another threat. It's always it's always, always another threat. But when the but when it comes from where where it's like I don't know, man. People understand what I'm saying. I get I'm, what you're saying. I'm just saying. It, I it's get what fucked you're up. That the motherfucker got to be like fish in the fishbowl and wait on the motherfucker to come knock this bitch off the motherfucking goddamn table and now flip it on the fucking floor, can't breathe. But that's the thing. As a person that's breathing the same as you. But that's the thing about that's the thing about armies and shit like that. Armies and shit like that are put together. Like that's why all our money goes into the the military and armed forces. How long have Ooh. armies and shit been here? Forever. Forever. But what I'm saying though, let me finish. Let me get to let me get to the end. What's the end goal? The end goal of what? Stopping motherfuckers from just doing stupid shit. But if you started creating stupid shit, how are you gonna stop people from doing stupid shit? What you mean by creating stupid shit? You steady creating shit. You steady upgrading. Every year it's something new. It's the new how it is. It's the new that. Stop! No. So that's, what I'm, that's why it's going to always be a fucking problem because we're too fucking eager to fuck some shit up. No, no, no. Because the world not, never stopped evolving. It's not, no, if we stop it, it will. It will not. I mean, it won't stop rolling, but if we I stop... I 
It, of course not. But the same shit. It's like, moving. That's because it's always an asshole after we, they want to try to do something believe, better than the next one. We all believe that. Well, I ain't going to say we all. But some people believe about governments creating diseases and shit like that. Okay, they might. For sure. Mixing the master and shit, broccoli, all this type of shit, created in a lab, right? That's just to say that nothing just ever came from the earth. No illness, sicknesses, diseases ever came from the earth. I was coming out now. These glaciers and shit. Exactly. Out. But that's what that's that's man shit too, though, because of global warming. But uh, well, I know, but the glaciers have been there for millions of years. Right. Right. This shit, so, shit in them. It's shit that's hidden inside that shit that motherfucker can't even explain. I know, exactly. But that's what I'm saying. So you tell the motherfucker, stop evolving. Stop. You so, cannot stop evolving because you don't know yeah. what's coming next. Because it's too late. You don't know what's coming next. I ain't talking you about stop evolving be. like that. I'm, talk, I'm talking about certain things. Like? Like, only thing I want to have to involve, like, okay, they went too far with the, with, with the uh, uh, Locomotive shit. All how they fucked up the ozone layer with all the smog and all that shit. They could stop. This car, it's just like if you look at a Bugatti. Do a Bugatti come out every year? Nah, that was a that was a main custom. Okay, so you trying to tell me this brand? I ain't gonna say no brand name car, but this car could have brought out a car and then brought another car out six months. Uh, six years, uh, three years, or two years later, and then came with another like we got. And it's what about I'm it's about it's about feeding your people. At the end of the day, the population you feed cars. them because you feed people them. People shouldn't have multiple cars. But look, I wouldn't even say people shouldn't have multiple cars because guess what? Having multiple cars does it take cars off the road. I'm saying if it ain't that many to purchase. Or if it ain't that many out there, it won't be that many polluting the earth. So, but you got, but you also got fucking, but now you, but how are people going to train you? Look, Carpool. it's all about. Carpool. You no, know, it's all uh, about. Transport, public transportation. But that's also polluting. That's it more, is. That's but it polluting. ain't. Uh, okay, but how, how, many drive, public, how many How many people drive a bus? But how many buses are there? How many cars are there? But look. But is one? I'm pretty sure it's probably like one bus adds a X amount of pollution into the air, can, as opposed to one Toyota Prius or some shit like that. So, let's just say if twenty Priuses don't emit what one city bus would, like yeah, it's gonna be more than twenty people driving that riding that bus in a day. But it's still fucking up the ozone. Like it's not gonna it stop. It is. But then, but you also see though, cars are moving towards electricity. The fucking that's why they they got rid of the the chargers and the and the. That's uh, a problem too. They got rid of the chargers, but now it'll be the. That's gonna be another left. Once everybody gets the electric cars, that's gonna put some shit in there. That's gonna be like an electric current, like a microwave. I mean, it's you, but you. That's what I'm saying, though. That's why you don't stop evolving because you never know what's coming next. Yeah, walk, motherfucker. That's why you got two legs. No shit. God damn it. Production walk. Okay, Ride a now. bike. Ride a bike. So you want, but you want people to work eight. You want people to work. Want, want people to work eight hours a day to keep the world moving. You we shouldn't have to work the, eight hours a day. But we got to keep the world moving. You could keep the world moving without working eight hours a day. Mm, I mean, we, I don't know why they Half the time you at work, you bullshitting you, I don't get know. Ha, you can get half your work done in four hours Honestly Can no, you get your shit done no, in four hours? Service, service industries are not You can't you can't time that with service industries Because now the why, service is not available you got, Do you have a lot no, of time? No, the person has to come To receive the service That too the service has to be done. But if they know they only had to do that shit, the service that the person they had to do it to only got four hours. Appointment. So they're gonna do it. Appointment times. Like I only got if this takes an hour for me to do right, and I'm working eight hours, I can only service eight people. So now I'm I'm here for eight hours. You ain't the only one else. But I'm not. It's not. It's a billion. It's but seven that, billion people in the world who but, need this service, though. But it'll adjust the same way that you have to do that in the eight hours. 
it was adjusted to doing that in the four hours. Now, and instead yeah. of them motherfuckers that sitting back there bullshitting there be calling people quicker. Just like if you go get your car fixed. The motherfuckers that's working there know they gotta be there for eight hours. The thing about they don't give no fuck about getting your shit out on time. The thing they about, gonna go on break. The thing about the thing about the world and trying to preserve it is we're always just gonna fuck it up. It's nothing we can do to stop that. Cause if, what you saying, what you saying, wow, boom, boom, boom. Yeah, it's just gonna create another problem. This you is know why, why? You know why people love problems. But you know why? No, just think about people it. People love problems. Like in 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 sci-fi with the whole space-time continuum. You cannot go and try to solve something because it's just going to create another problem. Problems are not you can't stop problems from happening. You can't stop problems from happening, but you can minimize. You can minimize. But if you just go in there thinking you can't stop problems happening, you can't even minimize. You can you can you can you can adjust to limit the issues. But there will always be issues. In everything. Everything is issue. There will be issues in But everything. you can minimize the issues. By not overdoing shit. But will there still be issues though? But you don't need to You'll never that. wake up. You'll never wake up. I'm gonna show you how to. You'll never wake up sometimes feel like you ain't doing enough. That's why I ask. Anything. You can pick what pick and choose. Anything. You never at this point in life. I, I ain't even talking about at this point in life. I'm talking about have you ever I'm woke well, up. I mean, yeah, we all feel like we Okay, can that's yeah. us as humans doing too much. It's enough to do too much. We overdo everything. And when it ain't no purpose, like you say, at this point, it should always be like that in life. Now, because you get to a point where you understand what life is, and once you once you start to understand what life is, like I, right, I could do something. Like you always talk about leaving behind the legacy. I, right, you trying to leave behind the legacy, but guess what you got to do? You got to leave it behind. Exactly, but only so, that, my point is life. That's what that's what I'm saying. It's just like if you to go to the casino. And you won, 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 and you won. You know, goddamn, I need to leave right now because I'm up. Like, I should have left. You should leave. I left my legacy behind because I won. No, I'm going to drop. I'm going to. Goddamn, goddamn, I just lost all my shit. That's what I'm saying. We got to learn when the fuck we up. But guess what you can't do? You can't. Well, you know, you know, you the, the biggest thing is greed. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's one of the most... Greed would have made me drop greed, that coin. Greed is, greed is the... Greed and gluttony. We're going to say greed and gluttony. Like, th- those are two things that are damn near ingrained in human nature. Why is that? Because we wasn't born with that. Because, no, we... we, we why can't I have it? Right, that's gluttony. Why can't I have this? If I got it, why can't I just do this? Like overindulgence. That's if you got it, is. you could. But I'm not talking about money. But wise. that's the I'm, I'm not talking about money wise. I'm saying if I got a box of cereal, now why can't I just eat the whole box? If it's yours, I mean it's mine. Why can't I eat the whole box? Because guess what? you know why? Now you you ask me. I'm asking. Because. You may be on a budget. You may, you may have just got this box of cereal and had this problem last week because you ate up all the cereal and you felt like, damn, I just bought this cereal. You see what I'm saying? So now why would I gobble it all down at once? I ain't hungry for it, I just want it. Exactly. That's but 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 we also have this thing in our mind where oh tomorrow's coming, I could buy another one eventually. No, we have this thing in our mind that tomorrow isn't coming. That's why people don't say it. No. I can't no. take it with me. That's the number one line in every world. I can't take it with me. But 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 tomorrow also means I got another opportunity to make more. But if you fuck up the re-up. That's also that's always a possibility. It's always like it's I always, live life like tomorrow's coming. Kind of, tomorrow is or isn't? Is. Okay, yeah. I don't live like, you live like, like tomorrow. It isn't? No, I live like it is. Like I'm, cause I'm hoping every day. We may need to do that. We that's a, that's what we wanted to lie. We want to ask the people: Do you live life as if it 
in no tomorrow or if because a lot of people like I say that boy down to a motherfucker work all year stack their money and shit nigga on vacation to me that's what I see and I, you know I always come back to this yeah, you I can't work to- all year cause that shit bothers me I can't it's work true. all year and then blow it in one, in one weekend who said blowing $1,500 is blowing it it's blowing it it's on a memory it's not blowing it fifteen hundred dollars. You can't make fifteen hundred dollars again. That's all you made in a year. Who said? But you saying blowing the whole year salary? Who going on vacation, vacation spending fifteen hundred dollars? Where you going? That's why I can't go. Cause I'm, I'm a asking you. I'm, I'm a spin fire right. A what? Nigga, I'm doing, I, I'm doing everything. Everything. I got two days to do everything. But you can't do everything in two days because you. Only where where I'm going? Shit closes. The way we were just talking about. This is what we were just talking about. But where I'm going hours. though? You just said people should stop working. Okay, now so you would not be able to. You would be able to do six hours worth of things. Probably not because, five thousand. Because listen, listen, time. The reason. The reason why time. Time. Where am I going stop. though? Daylight. Well, I the, time. the whole planting crops and all that shit. Daylight saving time. This is what it is. It's things you cannot do. At 3 a.m. that you can do at 2 p.m. So time says it's you got a certain amount of time to do shit throughout the day before shit closes. What you think about us running out of time? I heard something about five that days are bullshit. shorter. No. I understand that. But it made me think what would happen if it was all nighttime and all daytime? Well, if it was all nighttime. Either or. Yo, if it was all, I don't know. The, I don't know the consequences of an all. With nothing grow, with no vegetables grow. Nah, nah we have fake lights. Night we got fake lights. If it was night, but yeah, you can you can do shit. In we got fake lights now. Yeah, you, you can, can make yeah. plants yeah, grow yeah. now. Yeah, you could definitely do that. You know, you, so you see what I, I mean about right. how yeah. the time is different. Five, if it was back in the day, like we supposed been wiped off this fucking earth. But, but we have shelter and things. Just like the dinosaurs couldn't run from a tsunami. You wouldn't be able or a hurricane or a tornado. You wouldn't be able to grow enough trees to keep the oxygen levels up if it was all night. We have artificial air. We have machines that can tornado. make air. Oh, then this is talking about you have to, now you're creating a bubble that everybody lives in. That was gonna, you don't think you don't think at one point in time it's gonna be a bubble somewhere? In some galaxy, I don't know if it's gonna be here. I'm, just, I'm not. I wouldn't doubt it. But what I'm saying though, that's what I mean though. Like, so if, if it was all, if it was always night, now the you trees suffer. Recall. The, the trees suffer. I mean, I seen a lot of. Books. But like you just said, no, they grow weed in basements. I'm talking never about never ever had fresh sunlight. But, but trees will grow. But this is what I'm saying. So now we. Mm. But look. How quick can we make it happen? Is the question. Because if now, if now if the sun just stops, if the sun you ever just heard of a biodome? How quickly can we get it? There's plenty of biodomes for the entire fucking world. You really what think I'm the saying? The entire the, world would benefit off of the biodome. What you mean would benefit? Would you think? But that's what I'm saying, though. That's what I'm look, saying. Look, 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 what I'm saying, though. So if, if the world, if the sun just stopped emitting sun, mm. no sunlight, mm. no sunlight to grow the trees, mm. none of that shit, mm. that shit is going to die. Yeah. Quickly. Mm-hmm. And then we die. You can't blow the sun up. I was going to say, if you blow the sun up. No, I ain't saying that. No, I ain't saying that. No, you said it to stop working. It just working. You don't even have to blow it up. It's going to turn out. It did that before. Then it cut back on. I saw it. I took a picture of it. We was in the street with like, damn, like, like the movie. Don't look up. Dude. That was a motherfucking, uh, fucking. Nigga, that was some eclipse, sun. nigga. No, it was no eclipse. Yeah, it was the eclipse. No, 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 cause it happened. Then the news came on. I'm telling you, nigga. No, it wasn't, nigga. Who's telling me? I saw it. I hear you. I hear you. Can you, you stare at the sun? I hear you. Oh uh, yeah, I have. But can you stare at it? I have. And when you, looked away, and when you looked away, you see pink. You see pink. You can stare at the sun. It was an orange moon. That's the eclipse. No, 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 no. Not, if not, it's everybody would have been aware of this eclipse. Eclipse only happened in certain amounts of time. This was not one of those days where they say come outside and you can see a solar eclipse. That was not the case, nigga. I'm telling you, I ain't the only one. I'm not if multiple people are huts, and I think I told you this that day, and I took pictures, I'm sure you go to my old Instagram. What 
trying to say. Yeah, that motherfucker cut off. Then they came up talking about it would never happen again. Then we went to the fucking casino and went out there and it happened again. I was like, what the fuck? Hold on. But you know. Like, I don't like to talk about too much shit like that because I don't need no money. Because I really don't know if that would happen to y'all. <laughs> you know how y'all be. <laughs> <laughs> shit. But I know, hey, hey. What did you say? It was orange. Orange. It cut off. And then we saw the, we saw the, we saw the, uh, it started spiraling back around and then, then that bitch got hot as hell. Yeah. That shit was like 20, it was one of the huts. I'm going to say red because that's what pops up. This is something. Uh, yeah, because I'm tanked. Nigga, I'll show you. This time about dust bars. You go on my old Instagram. You go on my old Instagram page, nigga, and I, I took the picture and everything. Don't you know how the doc was on huts? You know, you know how, uh, uh, you know how, you know how the doc was on huts? We look, out, we were looking up to the point where people were walking in the streets just stopped and turned around and see what the fuck we were looking at. Well, you the boss goes or something right now. Yeah. yeah. And then the motherfucker, then the news came like, what you saw today will never happen again. I'm like, ain't this about a bitch? Because I told him, ain't this about a bitch? And that, and then when we went to the casino, sure enough. Like, what the fuck? Things happen in the world. Hold on. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking at your page. All you gotta do is look for the doc. I'm looking, I'm looking. Just look for the doc. This picture will be posted on the uh, on the social media <laughs> page. I'm just trying to make sure that people understand. Yeah, you gotta understand. They gonna get to see this too. So, so the doc. I'm looking. Watch the doc. I'm looking. I'm looking. Go back there. Let me see. I'm gonna have to find. It. <laughs> we know the world. The world is a, a very unexplainable place. Motherfucker, every day you're gonna find something new if you look. Like if you just gonna go and do the same shit every day, you gonna bump into the same shit every day. You gonna see the same people because we all in the same fucking schedule. We all got a schedule. So if you out there looking, you gonna find something new. Hey, it's right here. And that's a video. That's a song right there. I'm not looking at it, standing at it. Look at it. That bitch supposed to be blazing. And you came back out there, you can see the, the fire the shit circling around it. You see it? You look at it. It look like a dot in the sky. Yeah, I if you saw it on somebody it. else, shit, you would be like, that shit Photoshop. No, I wouldn't. It's red, though. Nigga, that's because. Yeah, but no, it wasn't. I'm gonna tell you what Google said. We're going to a says. picture of the sun. All right, Google said. I said red. You said orange, but said, but that's okay. but that's what I said. I said okay. It, it, I, I'm like I gave you the benefit. Like okay, oh, it probably was red. It probably was red. That's what I was saying. Like, okay, I'm gonna see because it's yeah, red. Yeah, that real quick though. Red. How was I able to even look at it though? I'm looking at it and I can see that that's red. But that's what I'm saying. What I see that? that it's red. I'm gonna tell you what Google say, nigga. Tell me. Come on. The red sun happens due to dust particles in the Earth's atmosphere. Most of these particles Reach bounce the blue light off of them, called scattering, but reflect the red light wavelengths, allowing us to see them. When there is more dust in the atmosphere, often thanks to volcanoes eruption, the red sun is more common. When did the explanation come out? This was posted June 9, June 20th, 2019. When, when was my video? 2015. Okay. My shit was first. They came up with the reasons for why that happened. Exactly, nigga. I ain't making this shit up. They created that shit should have been. You made, because you, 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 you know how you look like damn. My shit, my shit my shit was four years before that. Before that explanation, nigga. Okay. I didn't say you made it up. I didn't tell you you didn't see it. I said the sun probably didn't turn off. But they I came over that. They, they came with an explanation say anything, for that shit. Actually, it's fucking 2019. I but there, that there's shit more 15. shit about it, though. There's more shit. It's some shit in 2016. Yeah, they, they said you would never see this again. And we went to the fucking casino. And I'm like, what the fuck? They said we'll never. 
<laughs> and I think I remember that one. I just don't know. That was in the other phone, though. That wasn't it. <laughs> Nigga, hey, hey, I'll be making this shit up, man. I'll come up and be like. You made nothing up. I tell you, you didn't see it. You looked it up. I looked up <laughs> what causes a red sun, nigga. Hey, and that shit did they and they came up with the explanation in 2019. You gotta look into shit. If it's on Damn. you gotta look into it and figure it some out. Something new. Ain't that some shit? But when I said, when I, I told you that we started that's, that that's just that's what Google said on, at their top page. When no, they posted it. Ask that other bitch. What's her name? Ooh. Was, Siri? Yeah. <laughs> Hey man, I, I be paying attention, man. That's all. Uh, you want to have songs for players this week or not? I ain't got no song for no players. No song. I mean, you had a music topic though. You wanted to bring up. Yeah, bring right? it up. Music. You talking about the yeah? That was a good, good transition. You talking about young boy child in five hundred k? I thought it was two hundred. It said two hundred. The game said two hundred. So where the five hundred come from? Uh, that might be where he charges people. So I look at it like this. Either young boy taxing niggas now because he felt like he was blackballed. So if you want to verse me now, guess what? You got to pay. Because when y'all, uh, nobody want to fuck with me, now, okay, now you want to fuck with me. I think it backfired in games, though, because he was trying to do this magnif magnificent thing with his album. He knew what too many people wasn't rocking with young boy. So guess what? Him and Dirt got into it way back when at the club. I'm gonna side with him. Young boy say, because the young niggas don't care. Fuck you, pay me. I don't even see doing the song as sad, but go ahead. But so you don't see what? Doing the song as sad. Doing the song as sad. Sad with nobody. I don't think that's sad. I, I personally. Sad? No, yeah. no, 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 no. But we look who we talking about. Game moves strategically. He knows he's a he's a he's a professional button pusher. Certain people know how to shift the narrative. Certain people know how to make a hot topic, and that's a gift. Because guess what? The baby did it. Nobody fuck with him. My motherfucker canceling me. I'ma fuck with him. I'm coming out with this. You know, I, I made the Marshall this. I made the Marshall this. Ain't nobody making music with him. Let me make some music with him. The young boy probably was like, you know what? I see what you're doing. Man, I, nigga, I, I'm charging 250. You see, I just got 60 M's. Nigga, my verse is cost now. I got to pay this money. Like you say, you got to pay that money back. Nigga, my verse is cost. I need two, 200. I, I, I only charge you 200. It's business now. But I, I, I get game, though. Like, bro, I don't need your verse. I don't. I got 30 songs. The only reason Drake didn't get on my album is because he was busy. And I wouldn't have paid Drake. So, like... I don't need you. I don't need you. I don't need it. It would have been a good look for both of us. That's how people feel like that. Because it's like, bro, I don't think it would have been nigga. the other people think it would have been a better look for game. Of course. Of course. But but what I'm saying is game, right? Absolutely right though. Like. I ain't paid for no verses. And not only that, that's gonna be a reality check the young boys way. Cause everybody gonna be looking like, okay, oh right, yeah, what you doing, huh? You tired of niggas like that for her? Alright. No, not to ask him. But no, because nah, young boy, the young boy don't do features like that. Exactly, he don't have to. But he, but he also a motherfucker who already who 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 holds himself like, bro. I don't really fuck with you niggas. I don't like At you this niggas. Point. No, always been that way. He did songs with people, of course, but you got people you cool with because you had good interactions with them. At that point, you ain't. It ain't too many featuring NBA young boy songs on big artists albums. It's not. Who? It's not, it's not, but who? It's not, but who he reach out to? He don't have features on his shit like that. He got songs with Amigos. That's they song. Okay, so you just said either way, either way it goes. I'm saying you 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 meet people throughout who you fuck with, 
And I believe they're the same record label too. Record labels can make that happen. If we're on the same label. That's different. Let's not act like, like let's not let's come on, stop this shit. We gotta cut it out now. Let's not act like NBA Youngboy didn't want features from his favorite artists that he liked when he was growing up. Because he let it be known who his favorite artists are. I'm not saying, are. but you also meet your favorite he, and, artists and, and realize And, and why he get mad? Is. Because he feel like niggas wasn't fucking with him because they were taking sides. That's after, though. But still. I'm saying, look that, at his shit before know. Von Dad. Look at his shit before even Von the, Dad. Even before that. Even before that. Even before that. So you tell me, you, you, you tell me. Envy a young boy don't want. I'm finna look. I'm finna look. I'm finna look through his album. You trying to tell me? Well, I'm just telling you. You trying to tell me he don't want thirty eight to be at the Grammys? The first one. He don't want to see Kevin Gates. Them and people we never heard of. That's some New Orleans shit. I uh, that. I'm just. I'm looking. Twenty one. He got. He had a song with Twenty One Savage in 2016. Damn. Twenty One Savage announced in 2016. Before that. Shit. Damn, but I'm just saying. Why? Money, money bag yo in 2017. All the stars. The, but this one per album. But they would have grew together. Kiwi, and he would have had multiples. Yo Gotti. And That's he would have had multiples. So I'm just looking. He would have had some shit with Yo Gotti. That no real love. And they would have kept their relationship tight. I'm just looking. Yo Gotti. Fed Baby. Thug. Thug. Quavo. Thug. 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 Live but people and like him. QC people artists. like him. And then, no, then there's the Birdman connection. And the Birdman connection. But, but people so that would have like got him more music. Drake's. That would have got him more Drake's, Young Thug, I Features. Because these are all Birdman, uh, these all look, Birdman disciples. But all these niggas like his music, though. I understand that. So they're going to work But for some with reason, him. they ain't doing music with him. After he was just locked up. He out now. Been out. And now he's saying fuck everybody. His fault. But it's also, come on, look, 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 bro. We cannot act like it's not, I'm going to stay out of this. Like, and then if I'm hanging it's around. It's definitely I'm going to stay out I'm, of I'm, this. If I'm hanging around Dirk Heavy, why would Lil Baby go and hop on the NBA Young Way song today? Why would he do that? Because they ain't been knowing each other no more than three, four years. It don't matter. They not, come it on, don't what matter. you mean it don't matter? It don't matter. That's picking sides. I did a whole they album. Ass. No, I'm staying out of it. I'm but not it's saying business. I don't fuck with you, but this my homie. But it's business. This my homie. I don't know you. You think Lil Dirk don't know Lil Baby like that? He know that nigga since when? Since the day he met him. Right. From that time going. He ain't no 20 year nigga. What that mean? 20 year niggas. So your lawyer told you to ask the 20 year niggas? No, no, hell, mine. Only to 20 year niggas. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Every motherfucker in my closest conference, 20 year niggas. Okay. And last one of them. Okay, so you ain't got no friends you met in 20 years that you really fuck with who you gonna back up. I mean, you're gonna make me sound like a motherfucking jerk, but I, I can't think of none. Okay. Okay. That's all. That's all. Nigga, my wife, I, I've been married damn near 20 years. So, yeah, my wife. My wife but what I'm saying, that's though, shit. Like, but, Before that, the same shit, niggas. If y'all got beef, it's like, ah, man, I'll fuck with this nigga. This nigga cool. This nigga ain't never did me wrong. I have a better relationship with him than I do you. I'm not saying I don't fuck with you. I'm just saying that's not. Oh, no, you talk. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. Fire, fire, the motherfucker. No, like, ain't. Hey, I'm not told, saying me. No, no, people that I mean, I'm just, no, I'm just saying. Cause, cause, let me, let me re innovate. People that I have met that I've been knowing for like, cause, cause I, let me be honest. I am one of those type of people that think 20 years plus, but you do meet some people along the way. Now I can't call them my day ones, of but course. I'm not saying that. I'm not I saying know they wouldn't fuck me over, so therefore I wouldn't fuck them over. But that's what I'm saying. But, but that's rare. But at the end of the day, I'd be a damn fool if I was a church them that much. So, okay. To you broke think they me. would fuck me Y'all made money together. That don't mean nothing. But I'm just saying. So, you gonna pick a motherfucker you never made no money with over somebody you have a working relationship with that brings you yeah. income. I'll pick a motherfucker, yeah. You know why? Over some shit that I'll has nothing to do with you. I'll probably manipulate the numbers and I can get more money out this motherfucker than I can. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to hey, 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 sound, hey, real, I'm 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 sound real right. I'm going to sound real. But it's the truth. Okay. Okay. Then that's why a motherfucker wouldn't do it. Because why would I break bread easily with a new motherfucker? I'm going to try to get over. Just like you.
you gonna try to get over? Unless you just want them lying motherfuckers say, no, I wasn't trying to get over because I'm a motherfucking nigga. I'm a different type of nigga. I'm a wholesome nigga. No, it's not light. I'm trying to get over them. I don't try to get over people neither. But I'm just saying, that's just one of those answers. I wasn't expecting that answer. Like a I told you, it's two to sides to every coin, bro. It's two sides to every coin. And I had to let you know that it is that nigga out there that, that will get over. But, but what I'm saying, though, what I'm saying, we back to, back to the young boy and, and people choosing sides shit. If I'm their baby, I have no reason to do that. Uh, do what? To do Make a song with young boy? song with him now. Why not? You are the two, two of the biggest artists out right now. But I'm also... The fans want that. But I'm also with one of the other biggest artists. See what I'm saying? But I don't know this nigga like that. I know him because Since we made you, money together. But if we stop making tour, money together... You know how... That okay, way, so how we can't go on tour together? together? I don't... But... Don't understand what I'm saying? Now, you form a loyalty to who you come across first. Which is fucked up because yeah. that's Let me fucked see up with business. Let me see. Hold on. Hold because on. I, ain't done. I, ain't, I can't I ain't go on tour with this guy and the same relationship because together. y'all have some type of beef together. I'm taking food out of my kids' mouth because y'all don't get along. They might have had a song. That's all I'm saying. Because I know Lil I know Lil Baby had shit with Quando Rondo, so. They so the dirt and all of them. They all cool. They at one point in time. They all cool. And they all were fans of young. So people. now I can't build this same relationship with you. But you don't have nothing to do with the fuck y'all got going on. It's different though. No, that means whoever came to accept this is the bitch ass nigga. Alright, okay. No, no, y'all no, interfere no, no. with my business, no. but y'all bullshit. Can't bro. <laughs> y'all interfere with my business, with y'all bullshit. Nah, but what I've been looking all over. I I know, but look, now it, it comes down to a trust thing. Look, 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 look. Why would NBA young boy even allow a little baby around him? Knowing that, listen, listen, let me finish. L- knowing that this man has done a tour with Lil Dirt, has done an album with Lil Dirt, has been on one of DJ Khaled's biggest songs with Lil Dirt. These niggas was like a package duo. So yeah. now, wait, let me finish. Now, in order to do this song, say we, I'm, I'm going to tell you where I'm at in the studio, knowing I, what I've been saying and what I've been doing, like you can't easily pass that information along to Lil Dirt. If, Why if, would they if, do it? If, 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 if Lil Baby was uh, equally honest with both of them, could he not do both of them? Why do he have to be involved? If Lil Baby was equally... I'm saying, why would you... I'm, I'm, just, saying, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. I'm because not I'm, I'm a rapper. I'm a fan of both. I'm a this fan of young boys. No I'm though. a fan. I know it ain't, but I ain't do it. I still want to better my career. Why do I have to pick a side? So now it looks like I'm picking the side on who's the hottest. Because I could have split that shit down the middle. I could have kept my same relationship with this motherfucker, and I could have kept my same relationship with this motherfucker. When I talk to man. them. I could have been like, look, man, that's between y'all. I got One case got moved. I don't have nothing to do with that difference. shit. Look, that's between y'all. If if y'all if y'all got a problem with me fucking with both y'all, then I don't fuck with that one of y'all. I could have I could have done that. We took that side. I'm sure. That's what I'm saying. So with that being said, as a businessman, if I know Lil Durk the hottest motherfucker and Young Boy the hottest motherfucker and I'm one of the hottest motherfucker. I'm going to keep that shit to this. I ain't grow up with them. Lil Baby ain't grow up with Vine and them. Why, why is my money haltering because of... It's not that. I, it is that because... Not, you, it, it, that, okay, so now this... Is, your money not being altered. Your money not being... My stopped. money is definitely being altered it's because, not. you know, NBA boy fan is just as good baby. as Dirk fan, Lil Baby fan, all of them. So I don't need you. So, so guess what? And a lot what? of these fans overlap too. But like, what like, about the artists that I wish all of us could have got along? But not, but but circumstances. But what about what? Circumstances change that. Your circumstances. circumstances. I mean, from where y'all from? Twenty One Savage said this. Twenty One Savage. I heard him. I'm not. I'm not involved in none of that. You know, he chose the motherfucker that was seemed like that was the most profitable. But it's instead of just saying. Who's the I fuck with both of them. Young boy tends to 
Your boy's a loner. But I, exactly. But I fuck with both of them. So now you. My hands, I fuck with both of them. Especially if I done music with both of them. Yes, I and told we, you. I, I, I fuck with both of them. But that's my ass. I fuck with both of them. That's they shit. Whatever they got going on, that's they shit. Now, if, if one of them don't want to fuck with me because I don't want to get into they shit, then that bitch ass. That's they shit, though. I don't want to pause of it. You don't have to choose sides. You just said just say that. You don't have to choose sides. You don't have to. That's they shit. That's they shit, for sure. I fuck with both of them. But? Even answer. But? I fuck with both of them. If one of them get mad, I don't fuck with them. That's what it is. That's how life is. If one of them choose to say, oh, you still fuck with him, then guess what? Now I'm gonna fuck with this motherfucker more because I gave both y'all equal opportunity. Look, that's y'all shit. Now you put me in it. You put me in it. So now I don't have a choice because I can't fuck with you no more. This motherfucker understood what I was saying. So naturally, you were more petty than this motherfucker. So you hate this motherfucker more than you hate you. This shit really don't even have to be that much because you're mad. And he ain't mad, but guess what? This is all hypothetical, people. I know, I, but no, I know, I know, I know young boy took a shot. No, I'm that. just saying, I know young boy took a shot at a little baby. Well, I know. But Why, though? Because he, he was on the dark side. Yeah. This is what I'm saying, though. That was going to happen anyway. If, if little baby would have been like, I fuck with both of y'all, y'all mad at it. But I'm still coming out with the album because this is what the fans want. This is what's hot. You going through your shit. You know, you in and out. Ooh, ooh, I'm not putting my shit on hold. It, it's all politics. Mm-hmm. But motherfucker got to grow the fuck up, man. You want to touch, touch on, the, on the Quando Rondo situation? Oh, uh, that, that was transition. I, I, thought, I was going to tell you good transition. Yeah, you talking about how these motherfuckers think they're untouchable. And you don't know who did it, cause you don't know who did it, cause y'all talking like y'all untouchable. Yeah. What you thought was gonna happen? Yeah. You I think mean, motherfucker playing with you? You think these niggas playing? Not to put that on. I'm not putting that on this. I ain't putting that on nobody. Situation. I'm just saying. Because Quando is claims a gang, right? Quando Rondo claims a L.A. street gang. L.A. Yeah, L.A. I mean, he's not from L.A., but where did the Crips come from? Where does the crypt set that he claims come from? LA, right? So, them niggas out there don't what? give no fuck. That's where they got shot at. They got in, shot LA? in LA? Yeah. Mm. They got shot in LA. I, I, I ain't know that. He moving. So, he finally left from about a way he, he was He probably from. had some business out there. If I'm not mistaken, what record? Is he? I think he on Interscope. Interscope offices is in LA. I'm just saying, the fact that you moving around now. These motherfuckers think this shit is a game. That's the problem with young people. They think this shit is a game. You not in a position where you can wait for shit to die down. This ain't like you don't have no money, you don't have no name, you in the hood and you waiting on shit to die down. You cannot wait for shit to die down. It's just like that game at Chuck E. Cheese. Motherfucker waiting on your, the mold to pop up on your, bah, bust your ass outside your motherfucking head, boy. Yeah. Nigga, you have to be in hiding forever now. It ain't even just that. L.A. a dangerous place as is. And it's big as hell. hell. That's what I was also saying about the whole L.A. shit game. You claim Crip, a certain section of Crips, who have beef in L.A. Bruh. Are you kidding me? You can't be liking like that. This ain't your hood. You ain't in Georgia. You can't, and you can't think that... Riding around. And in the end, Batman, if it's not... If L.A. niggas ain't the only nigga that live in L.A. Yeah. And like motherfuckers say, like you say, everybody got ties to different people. Everybody got ties to different people, boy. Yeah. And... And... The world is full of serial killers that ain't being known as serial killers. So they can't wait to be the one to get you. Yeah. And the world won't even know it. It'll be a private, it'll be a private fucking celebration. Yeah. Maybe. Everybody go to No, I'm just saying. Everybody move to LA. Everybody move to fucking Atlanta. And everybody move to LA. (laughs) But Nigga, you thought you... What? 
That what happened there. I thought that boy was at the crib getting gas or something. He was in the L.A. where everybody at. It was reported to be Georgia at first. That's why everybody thought that because mother was just saying something because they knew he had got shot. And he didn't even get shot. Only his homie got shot. But he got killed. His homie got killed, yeah. That's what I'm saying. That could have been him. Yeah, it could have been him. Could have been him. Y'all playing around, boy? These boys ain't playing with y'all, man. Y'all think y'all just... That's, I mean, we we didn't seen so many like, come on, we we live, we just seen like, my boy ain't get playing shot on, every day. Yeah, you definitely right. That's what I'm saying. Why would you play with that? Hey, you how long ago that? That's just like that's perfect time. That's just like with the fucking PPP loan. That was two years. They told you two years we coming. Same shit. Motherfucker, let shit die down. You think shit die down? Motherfucker, don't forget they let you stir up bullshit. And then guess what? Laying in the weeds. Laying in the motherfucker. Well, you, hey, this shit crazy, man. This world crazy, man. But what you think about that? Get though? back never ends. What you think about that though? All this. Uh, I guess we're just waiting to see for who all get forgiven for that. I mean, that's, that's we, I mean, we did it. Man. We did it last week, so it ain't no, ain't nothing else came out. I don't think nothing. Oh, yeah, some did come out. Some did come out. In regards to that situation, yeah. I mean, they're investigating it. The investigation has been extended to ten years. So shit. No, some People old shit. What motherfuckers should know a year ago. The, I had seen some shit the Breakfast Club they did. I, I thought it was new. Cause it popped across my screen for some reason. I don't know. They hear what the shit you talking about, and then they put the shit out there for you to look at. The motherfucker girl, old girl did the GoFundMe page talking about they had to ask for doing the 20. See, I thought it was only going to be the big people. The big people. Yeah. But she, a year ago, she was talking about they were on her ass for doing the 20. She probably fucked up. Like, did some stupid shit. It's a bunch Wasn't of dumb motherfuckers. Shit? It's a bunch of dumb motherfuckers who gonna get got for that shit. Hellcat me LLC. Uh, we on the block, LLC. Hey, we out here, yeah. LLC. I'm finna go shopping like crazy, LLC. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. Like, y'all was just doing too much. Like, I'm like, dude, that shit six different times with different people's names. And they own that. Got like, come 100 on, like, employees. Yeah. Ooh. You push the envelope. You gonna be the, I'm gonna be the first ones to get gas. But that's the I'm thing. We talked about it last year, but do you think that was like a bait truck? Depending on how many people did. You know what the bait truck is, right? Yeah, I know what the bait truck is. I it was a bait on the fucking Central Park one day. So I think I think the PPP right the loan was pretty much like that whole bait oh, truck. Right past that motherfucker, like I ain't no way in here. This cop been over. We've been over here hooping all this time. This cop been sitting there. Waiting on the white over there, the and the motherfucking door open. The bitch running. It's like this guy just been here. Like no, you forgot here. I seen a couple but, of but um. I think it'll be something where they, like I say, the motherfuckers who really did it took them for millions, 600K, shit like that, they're going to go and get. The people who did the lower level shit, 20K, I think it'll, it'll probably be some type of penalty. I don't think nobody going to. They got to pay that back, but they're not going to get no jail time, but they ain't going to get no tax return. It's going to be different levels of fucking penalties. That's how I'm going to say that. <laughs> I, everybody won't be penalized under the same guys. I That's part of the recession, though. Level. That's part of the recession. That's why they plan their recession. That's why they think it's going to be a recession because how you going to do that? recession ain't got nothing to do with the people, though. You got to pay that loan back, though, and still buy groceries, and still make rent. Why paying back the loan at yeah, some point? The recession time? don't really got nothing to do with us, to be perfectly honest. You know that. The, per- the recession got everything to do with the automotive industry, the airplane industry, and the banks. That's how the recession really revolves around. What you talking about? Five bringing in cargo? I'm calling it a recession. That's what I'm saying. No, I disagree. The recession don't really got shit to do with us. Try to huh? It it cause. The recession ain't got shit to do with us. Don't it ain't got nothing to do with you guys. We've been, been through a recession our no. whole fucking life. That's what I'm saying. Motherfuckers been broke. The recession ain't got shit to do with us. Like, I'm still... But, going, my job ain't, My job don't get cut. The recession ain't got nothing to do with me. If your job don't get cut, the recession has nothing to do with you. That's a fact. But your job ain't get cut during the fucking pandemic. Certain motherfuckers didn't, but certain people did. But, but it's not a pandemic now. 
It's a recession. Difference. What's it's the difference? difference. If, if shit don't start, but shit could start shutting down. Shit could start shutting down, but there, that's that's why they, that's where bailouts and all that shit come from. That's why all the bailout money is spent. Not really. How, nigga? They print money. You can print shit. That don't mean they I can print the paper right it. now. They're saying that don't mean it's a legal dollars. document They're that has. That's all. That's what everybody think. Let's let's get over that. I'm gonna be the one no, to tell y'all this. No, no. Everybody they has to stop me. using that fucking shit. They print money. Okay. They print money, but that is not what gives the paper the value. The or they wouldn't burn it. The then let's keep it. Availability gives the paper the value. I know you don't have to tell me this, but what I'm saying. So don't just say, "Oh, they print money." They'll create it. They'll create the situation. They can just give billions of dollars to Ukraine. They can just give. They're going. This is why I say. Let's. This is why I say it has nothing to do with us. Well, what is it coming listen, from? Listen, listen. Because if the if the if the uh, if what the the airlines, hold on. If the air, us, nigga. I know about. exactly. If the airlines, so they ain't gonna hurt us. If the airlines have an issue, guess what they're gonna do? They're gonna bail them out. If the banks have an issue, guess what they're gonna do? They're. This has happened. Obama did it in '09. That's why I tax dollars. But you know what that means? That means, but it, 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 it it's not only about the paper. It's about the labor. It's the labor. We have to convince the people to do the work. We will. We have to it. convince the people to do the work. Okay, that's what you said. The airlines. The airlines. The taxpayers will pay us out of the recession. Listen. But them calling a recession has nothing to do with the small. The airline. The airline. They can bail the airline out, right? I can't say. They can bail the airline out, right? They can. They can. If it's a recession, listen. If they if it was that easy for them to bail the airline exactly. out, let's say for instance the, the stewardess, the pilots, the uh, 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 the, the, the 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 fucking everybody that worked for the uh, airline going on strike, yeah. mm-hmm. who gonna bail them out? That's not the same. Who That's gonna fly the plane? I'm just saying though. But, that don't have nothing to do with the recession though. But it could be. But that that but no a strike. If is, everybody in every airline across the world just say fuck y'all, we done. I'm trying to, I'm trying to respond to you. How do how, how she gonna move? That ain't, that ain't, that ain't got nothing to do with the recession though. They're already you on just strike. said that. I'm you just telling you that. What you say called the, the recession? I'm telling you, you this. three things. Name them again. The airline, airline, automotive, and bank. So how how? Explain me now how. Listen, you got you know people they they're striking right now. Mm-hmm. People people are they're striking. No. The uh, the airlines are striking mm-hmm. right now. Like certain certain people are, sh- they're making they're intentionally making people miss planes. They're intentionally causing delays. They're intentionally leaving people in mm-hmm. Puerto Rico come, trying to come back to mm-hmm. go to work on Monday. They're intentionally doing that for more money to yes. show them that they need them. Yes. Okay. And but how you get that money? If the airline saying we ain't got the we don't got the money we don't got the money. But what don't the government want? The but gov- if they say we don't have the get money. To the point. The government don't want people stuck nowhere. They want this error system. Why? My job. Let me finish. Let me finish. You finish it. My job even depends on that. Packages, mail. It's all on the bottom of fucking commercial airlines and shit like that. So we cannot stop the economy. So guess what we're going to do? We're going to cut them a check to pay them pilots and all that shit so we can get this shit back started. And guess what's going to happen? As soon as we get this shit back started, we're going to file this investigation and find out what the fuck is going on. What investigation? Because, what you mean? Investigation into what? Into what? What you mean? Into what? I wish I could rewind it before you cut me out when I was going to say it. I wish I could rewind it and go back to exactly what I was going to say before you cut you me out. You was trying to cut me out. No, I'm just saying, because I hear it right there. But you, you, you got to hold your so fucking, you got to so hold your thoughts if I'm talking, I can't bro. hold my thoughts that long. That's not the same, man. Podcasting. I couldn't hold that thought that long, motherfucker. Yeah, but you knew that. Bro. That's why you did that shit. Nigga, I'm ass, in the middle. Yeah, I have man, even fuck that. To my point. Your man. ass, and then furthermore, me three times in that. And furthermore. No, because you tried to cut me off. Let me talk. Boy, you knew I had you that. Know what sto- you know what a, a story is, right? Yeah. A, a, a beginning, a, end, a, a middle, middle, and, and a end. conclusion. And, and I 
I get to the conclusion? Shit. Yeah, damn though. But sometimes you I see you patiently and let your ass but finish. Sometimes you don't need to every time. You ever wrote a book report? I sit here and let you finish every time. I let you get to your conclusions. Boy. You gotta afford me that same luxury, man. We finna go live. Yeah, we are. Seven with the real. I enjoy that show. Seven with the real episode one fifty three. Thank you for joining me. Jada, up, Jada, off the whoop. We'll be back next week. We about to go live on Facebook. Make sure y'all follow the Facebook page so y'all can tune in. Sip, sip. We sipping with the real, y'all drinking with the fakes. The haters getting mad cause they cannot relay. Your girl tuning in, trying to hear our latest takes. I told her she can come, yeah, we saving her space. When sipping with the real, probably acting the cup. Soon as we finish one, yeah, we back to pulling up. These other niggas' pies ain't getting real as us. What we say is what we mean, so y'all gon' fuck with us. Sip, sipping. Sip, sip, and sip, 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 and sip, sip, and sip, 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 s